a lot of my friends just didn't understand what I was going through. They always say, hey, wow, you family business means you are, you are like a asiakia or, or like rather so you're just some rich kid who, who doesn't need to lift a finger or doesn't need to work. And that's a misconception about family business. The onus is on us to work even harder to show that we actually have the ability to run and lead the company. When I first came back to the business, uh, there were a few obvious things that I, I had to uh, meddle in or, or to change. We didn't have modern day practices in terms of like your organizational um, structures. Uh, so staff would come to you for every single thing. We didn't even have a leaf uh, management system, not even an Excel. So everything was uh, remembered by, by, by head. been doing a lot of our processes through the experience of our old workers. So nothing was formalised. Everything was based on what the craftsman would do and tell you. It's like, for example, how many bags of sugar he would use to cook rock sugar. Uh, only he would know. We didn't even know how many, uh, how many bags of uh, sugar would be produced a day or what was the recipe behind it. So one of the first few things was to set up some sort of organisational structure um, and then that took me uh, seven years in total to modernise the business. So at Cheng Yu Heng, we have a lot of employees who have been with us uh, for more than 30 years. We also try to accommodate and to regulate change so that it doesn't render them obsolete. So one of the reasons that we went into retail at that time was also because we were automating our equipment. So we thought having a retail line would, would mean that these people who would be replaced by machinery could still work in the retail line. Uh, where they would make like rock sugar sticks. We have about 20 over startups uh, in agri tech, deep tech, uh, and then commercialization, scale up, come out of products. One of our many few startups does um, milk in the lab. So basically, they uh, grow cells that secrete milk and then. Uh, so you don't need the cow anymore. We also have um, startups that make use of tofu waste and make it into alcohol. Besides the food incubator, we have a co-working space. Um, we have a lab and a kitchen which the startups can use. The one lesson that I think um, should resonate with every family business owner is to find your passion in the business. Because if you don't find a passion in your business, you will not be able to lead and work happily in the business.